Hi everyone, this is Vivek from Tech 101. In this video, I am going to show you how you can test REST API from VS Code. So without any delay, let's start our video. Before starting our video, be sure to subscribe our channel and click on bell icon to receive notification of our upcoming videos. So first of all, uh, let's open VS Code. And in the left hand section you can see an option for extensions there you have to download an extension named thunder client ok and if you simply search thunder then you can see the uh, first result named thunder client click on that and install this extension for vs code so let me install it by clicking on install and now uh, the plugin is installed successfully and it is in enabled globally so uh, for now i'm going to use api from uh, request okay uh, this is one of the popular uh, api testing site okay uh, you may have already using it okay, so uh, uh, we can make different request here get post put pass delete okay we will try some of these uh, okay so let's try uh, to get list of users okay so request url is uh, request dot in slash api slash user uh, what page equals to two okay so let me copy this url let me simply click on this and i can find the url here okay and the expected response is this okay let's make uh, the same request from uh, our extension okay so uh, again come in the left hand section and click on uh, three dots and there you can see the option for thunder client click there and here uh, you can see an option to make a new request okay click on it and in this drop down menu you can uh, simply switch the request type okay uh, here different uh, types are available like get post port put delete okay patch okay so uh, uh, the request that we are going to made is get for now okay so let me paste the uh, request sorry url okay and now click on send as you can see here uh, the status is 200 okay and here is uh, size and time and our response is here uh, here we have list of users in page 2 okay so as you can see here so let's make a post request okay so let me create a user okay so uh, we are going to uh, insert uh, these details okay name and job uh, for now let me okay uh, the url is request dot in slash API slash users okay post request API slash users and inside the body you have to pass the uh, details of user okay so for now let me copy this and change the value Okay, it can be anything. Okay, and be sure to switch it to post. Okay, 
now click on send as you can see here uh, the user is created successfully and the name is Muru job is president ID is 71 and time is current time is time so guys how's this video if you like this video give us a thumbs up and if you have any problems while following the steps shown here please don't hesitate to comment below thank you for watching